hello there um this is ren here and today i want to talk about the mbti personality types also known as the mayor's briggs type indicator so some of you may or may not know what the mbti personality types are um so basically there are a total of 16 personalities um, it shows us about how different people with different characteristics deal or react to different situations through through introversion, extroversion, um, thinking, feeling, judging, intuition, and perceiving. So the reason why I want to talk about this today is because I feel like um, a lot of people should know more about themselves and I want to put this out there because the MBTI person knowing the MBTI personality types have helped me grow a lot and this could possibly help someone out there a teenager like me who is possibly going through a hard time maybe they could learn from you know knowing all the types they don't have to know all the types but um yeah so what can you learn from um knowing about the mbti personality types now through my own experience i think that the mbti personality types have expanded my point of view on life it has helped me look at things from really different perspectives and putting myself in other people's shoes. Um, it Basically, it has helped me grow as a person. Uh, I'm not saying that I have reached, reached enlightenment because I'm still a teenager and there's still so much more out there for me to learn and experience. Um, but what I'm trying to say is that Knowing about those personality types have helped me become more content with who I am and with the people around me or like with what I do. Um, it has helped me give myself some value and embrace my own unique uniqueness. Um, like one would compare themselves to other people because they think that they're different but in fact they're in truth they're they're just they're just who they are and there's no point of trying to change um knowing the mbti personality types have 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 helped me gain the sense of belonging and you know some of you might think that oh if you f if you know about your type then people are types and like people have types that does that mean there is division in in society or you know how like how people would label themselves and then there would be the superior and then there would be the inferior no what we're not like knowing the mbti personality types is not putting people in boxes and and categorizing them uh to be this or that it's like i said it's it's just to to make yourself feel like you belong somewhere to to make yourself understand about who you are or just you know for example your friend might be a different type and it's it's hard to understand them but if you know about the MBTI personality types, you will be able to understand your friend a little more. So then you would ask yourself, how do I find my type? Um, it would be a little tricky because there are 16 personality types in total. And since you're new to this, um, but when I, w I, when I first started, to look into the personality types i was also really really curious of what i could be so like any other typical teenagers would do with with like really low 
financial access to anything um, I I tried a few free online tests and the the results came out the same and it was really uh, assuring somehow but as I started to look deeper into um, the types of personalities and how people actually got to know their um, personality types I figured that there are people who got mistyped and despite months of search and so you know the test could be inaccurate for some people um, so then I started to become skeptical of my own personality type and then um, and then I just stopped uh, you know trying to identify myself as that I just look try to look more into it I, I tried to look more into other personalities if if I was actually um, another type but it's when you actually um, resonate with them like when you find the right type you would feel like you should try to not just look at the positive like the healthy aspects of your personality but also you know like dig deep into the core of it like try to look into the the unhealthy aspects of it and when you finally find the right when you finally find the right type you would feel offended and that was like that was how i actually felt i actually felt offended and then i started to watch youtube videos where there are like other people who identify them as the same type as mine and they just resonate like it just resonates so much it's painful to, to the point where I just okay I'm surely this type and I don't think I have to look into it further because this hurts me it offends me as an individual and and because I see the flaws of myself being talked on YouTube you subconsciously feel embarrassed and then you try to change the flaws and um, yeah basically that's how I found my type I don't know if that's actually you know if, if this would if this is actually the right way to find the personality types but I sure hope this is helpful to someone out there um, so yeah I think that this is all for the video today and I apologize if I stutter a lot if I sound really awkward if you know <laughs> but yeah I hope this would be helpful somehow to anyone out there at least one person <laughs> I don't know but I hope everyone has a good day and yes this is all for today goodbye